guys so guess what I'm back and I'm going to do my first Q&A today so um, these are questions that uh, you guys have asked in the comments or questions uh, for this video in specific or questions that um, people have asked throughout the the videos that I posted before and uh, yeah I have only four questions one two three four five 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 questions but yeah let's start people have asked me these questions a uh, this question a lot of things uh, and it is where is my accent come from and where I am from so I'm from Portugal it's a beautiful 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 country uh, if you want to know where it is you know Spain in the in the maps so Spain is not like Spain and Portugal are not the same thing Spain is not the old chunk of that little thing after France we have a little chunk of it um, near near the sea and we have a excellent food and excellent places to visit and it's beautiful really um, and yeah people always ask me that so yeah uh, one person asked me if I two person two people ask me this question at, actually have I tried a jelly baby no I haven't because in Portugal we don't have jelly babies we have like gummy bears and um, gummy worms and gummy sharks and gummy everything we we even have gummy snakes and gummy tarantulas and it's disgusting but yeah I have we have a lot of those things but we haven't jelly babies we have we do not have jelly babies I I I'm curious to to try them but I can't get any so yeah uh, one person asked me if this if you if you had some input on Moffat's storyline which character would you brought back and why um, I don't know this one because um, I think the I don't know the obvious question would be the pawns but I don't want the pawns back back because the pawns had, had a beautiful storyline and it ended okay it ended in tears but it ended well like they were happy with their lives and they they done beautiful things with their lives and he, they had a adopted child and everything and um, I don't want them back. A character that I really look, I really want back. It's Sally Sparrow from the episode Blink. I think she had a beautiful character, a beautiful personality, and um, she she didn't need the doctor actually to solve the case. She did it for herself, and I think she would have she would be a very 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 good companion because of that. She doesn't need, oh my god, doctor, she figured things out for her, on her own. So that's a very important thing. And uh, other, uh, the, um, the, the doctor's daughter, Jenny, yeah, I think she would be a very, very, very good character to bring back maybe one, two, three episodes, maybe. Not like many episodes, but one or two episodes would be cool because it's a character that didn't have any, an end to her um, a story so yeah that would be very very cool to see her again I don't know um, yeah maybe that and um, yeah I don't I don't like to imagine the story lines very much because I want to be surprised when you, when they get here so if we i don't know if i think if you if you imagine a lot of things the one of the one of two things will happen you will be disappointed because it's not the thing you want 
or you will not be surprised because the thing you want happening you already kind of know what happened so yeah I think it's cool to be imaginative but not too much so you can be surprised when you got the thing um, other question what's your favorite line from the doctor so this line it's not a line it's like a speech and it's not um, not my favorite line or catchphrase it's like a moment I love uh, it, this is one of those moments that I really loved and I almost know by heart but I have written in here I have like a river song, a river song diary that I made myself and it's full of quotes I, I literally don't have any more pages this is my last page of, of the diary and yeah in the in the last page I have like the Tarkis and all the names that the doctor called her like sexy, time and relative dimension in space, blue block, blue box, police box, best ship in universe, uh, type 40 Tarkis, things like that and I love that uh, and I have like a lot of things like I don't know and I have the quotes and the people who said them um, uh, beneath it like for for example I have uh, your girlfriend isn't the most important thing in the universe and and then I got this uh, I don't know if you can see or focus I don't know I don't know but uh, it says Rory punched the doctor. She is to me! I love that so much. But the thing that I chose from here, I chose it because I wrote this from from my memory. I I love this thing so much that I wrote this from my memory and it's the 11 doctor speech uh, on the Pandorica Opens at episode. And it says Hello Stone Edge! Who takes the Pandorica takes the universe! But bad news everyone, cause guess who? <laughs> Listen you a lot, you are all whizzing about and really, it's really very distracting. Could you all just stay still for a minute because I am talking! Now, question of the hour is, who's got the Pandorica? Answer, I do. Next question, who's come and take it for me? Come on, look at me. No plan, no backup, no weapons. Where the them? Oh, and something else. I don't have anything to lose. So, if you're singing up there in your silly little spaceships with your silly little guns and you got the pl uh, plans to take in the Pandora tonight, just remember who's standing in your way. Remember, very every black day you you were, you were ever stopped and then and then you do the smart thing and let somebody else try first and I love this so much I the first time I saw that episode I was really really I I had goosebumps all over me and I love this this speech it's so beautiful and I this was the moment that I kind of fell in love with the 11 I like them I like him uh, like in the fifth episode that he was in the in the season uh, uh, five because I I love Tan and so we yeah, it's I really love them but uh, it was kind of hard to like uh, Matt Smith after Tennant but this speech really uh, speak to me on the level like this is still the doctor this is the doctor speaking to us and this is amazing so shut up and shut your whiny face <laughs> because I was like oh damn that's why uh, yeah I love I love this little block it has so much stuff in it I don't know I things like uh, beans are evil bad bad beans or I don't know uh, 
I don't know. I have, um, in the first... It's falling apart because I know this, does, this stuff so much. In the first couple pages, one, two, three, yeah. The first couple pages I have the first and the... Uh, and the last uh, phrases of the doctor, each doctor, like the first doctor, the first is, what are you doing here? Um, and the last is, oh yes, thank you, it's good, keep warm. Things like that. Um, I don't know, like... Um, I don't know. Oh, the nine doctor is... The first is run and the last is rose. Before I go, I just want to tell you, you were fantastic, absolutely fantastic. And you know what? So was I. I love this so much. And uh, when I wrote this, the uh, Matt Smith hadn't regenerated. So I wrote like the very speech that he did legs, I got legs, and I'm a girl. No, I wrote that and I. I didn't have the space, so I just wrote the last I will always remember when the doctor was me. And I love that. I love that speech too, like the um, uh, change is good, we need to change. Um, we are all different people through our lives, but uh, the, the thing we need to remember it is that we, we can't forget the people that we used to be. I love that so much. Uh, and uh, after the first and last phrases of the doctor, I have the um, uh, after afterward the um, the thing that um, Amy wrote to the doctor, and I know that by heart too. I love that so much, and yeah, I, I have so much things. I have the where is my wife when the when Rory comes and gets and get Amy. Okay, I'm mumbling. So yeah, I love this so much. I need to make a video about all the things that I have here. It's amazing. So yeah, last question that I have here. Have you seen any episode of the classic era? I am so bad at this. I have seen it. I have seen the first episode and the second episode of the first Doctor, uh, but I haven't seen any other, I have seen like a couple of of Tom Bakers, but I haven't seen any because when I get to the classic era, I need to watch it like in one sitting. I saw the Doctor Who in one sitting. I saw from season one to um, the Angels Take Manhattan in one in one week. I saw. Uh, I sat on my on my bed in, on Monday, like 5 a.m. Monday, and I saw the Angels Take Manhattan on the other Monday, like uh, on midnight Monday. So yeah, it was very, very, very time-consuming, but I loved it, and I. It was one emotional week because I saw Rose, Donna, the Ponds, River Song, like go. And I just cried so much that week. It was, it was painful, painful, but it was amazing. It was one of the most amazing things that I did in one week. So yeah, I see you in the next uh, Q and A. Uh, and yeah, uh, tell me the things you want to know. I'm going to do a favorite video f uh, for the doctors, the companions, and the monsters. So yeah. Tell me the things you want to know about me. Bye-bye.